Power BI Desktop Basics continues, and today we're going to show you how to import a Excel file with DAX measures and a complete model, and how you can import that directly into Power BI Desktop. So this may come about when you've had a file completely done in Excel with measures and the model is ready to go, and now you're ready to do some visualizations. Also, you may have a member of the team that maybe does everything in Excel, and now you're ready to import all of the measures into Power BI Desktop. How you do that is open up Power BI Desktop, File, and there's a button called Import. And what you're going to do is select Power Query, Power Pivot, Power View, and then you select the file. In this case, it's going to be Demo, import DAX into Power BI. You hit open. Now, when you import this, you're going to start the process and you can either copy the data from the Excel file or keep the connection. In this case, I have it connected to an Excel spreadsheet. So we're just going to copy the data into this Power BI desktop file. And while it's working, what you'll see is you have three queries and then you have a data model that was copied, three items, and then you have all of your measures, which include total sales, internet orders, unique internet customers, first purchase date, last purchase date, and a whole bunch of these orders. So now you just hit close and what you see on the right hand pane is query, an internet sales query, and an I.O. number. And under my internet sales, I have all of my measures. Uh, percentage of orders under $100, percentage of orders over $1,000, and all of the measures loaded right into the Power BI Desktop file. That's a look at another edition of Power BI Desktop Basics. Make sure to hit that subscribe button to learn more about Power BI Desktop.